Hey guys, welcome back to Tools on a Budget. Uh, quick video here today. This video was sponsored by Timu. Um, so all the products here pr were provided by Timu. Um, if you guys don't have Timu, uh, I highly recommend you guys download the app. Uh, it's a cool little app where you just, you know, you can just buy a bunch of knickknack stuff here and there. And they also sell pretty cool stuff like um, tools. I've even bought a couple of game consoles on there, the little, like the Game Boy style um but overall usually when you first log into the app they will give you like a pretty big discount um and not especially with the code i'm gonna give you guys i'll put it down in the description below uh, make sure you use that code and you guys will probably get a even heftier discount um they haven't told me exactly how much it's going to be but uh when i i will put that in the description uh when they do tell me how much the discount will be or um i think it's like a hundred dollar offer for hundred dollar worth of coupons when you first join uh through the link uh so be sure to go into the description and check um and check the link out also if you guys buy any of these tools from timu um let's say let's say you buy this hammer for 20 bucks and you log in let's say two weeks later and it's seven dollars because believe me or believe it or not that does happen a lot on timu uh you just go ahead and, and uh reach out to them and they will refund you the difference um, of, the, of the item. So basically, if you spend 20 it goes down to 7 they'll give you your $13 back. Uh, has happened to me quite a few times, and it does work. Um, they do give you 30 days for that. So if you, if you see a price drop within 30 days, um, go ahead and let them know, and they'll take care of you guys. Um, like I said, the, a lot of these tools, uh, they may not be the best. Uh, but they'll get the job done. They're pretty decent. And like I said, all these tools were sent to me out, sent out to me by Timu. Uh, but if any of these fail or anything, I will be sure to let you guys know. Um, so don't worry about that. Um, I'm not gonna lie to you guys and say, "Oh, it's a great tool," even though it's not. Um, but so far, from what I've got bought from Timu, uh, most of them have been pretty decent tools. Uh, let's start out with this four-pound hammer uh, by I think it's JE Tech. So this is just a regular four pound hammer. Um, I'll try this out and then I'll let you guys know how this one performs. And this is a this is a tie rod CV boot kit. Uh, basically, whenever you do like the inner tie rods, you gotta rip off that uh, this these clamp style connectors, and uh, sometimes you can't really put them back. On some some cars, they are reusable, but most of them are not. So you just buy these. And you use this tool, crimp it back on there, and no problem. You're not going to be leaking any grease and having to go back in there and prematurely change them out again. Um, this is uh, my favorite item that they sent me. These uh, long wrenches. They, they seem pretty good. Um, we'll put them up to a test right now. Try it out a couple times. Uh, see how they perform. Overall, they look like good wrenches to me. Uh, they don't look too cheap. They also sent me out this uh, this hose clamp set. Basically, you just you can go ahead and hold that clamp set, and then you just lock it. So it's locked. So in order to unlock it, you just do that, and then it'll come up. Um, sometimes you have a little bit of trouble with uh, with regular clamps where you're holding it, and it it just unlocks and flies somewhere. Um, these are basically just whole hose clamp pliers. Uh, these are just to like clamp him down. Let me show you guys real quick. So it does have this uh, this soft right, this like uh, softer plastic here, so you don't really damage them. So you just pretty much clamp it. That's it. They also sent me this. Uh, this impact uh, screwdriver. So basically, uh, if you guys have ever done any Toyotas, I know they're not Phillips, but uh, they are. I, th I, th I forgot what it's called. Let me see if I have the bit here. Uh, no, these are just Phillips heads too. I, I forgot what it's called, but it's a Japanese standard, which is basically similar to Phillips, but a little pointier. Um, anyways, if you've ever done rotors on a Honda, You'll know what I'm talking about. Those little placeholder screws. 
um, they have a tendency to screw, um, strip but if you use one of these just put it hit it it'll 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 uh, take it off pretty pretty easily um, I want so I want to test this out see how this performs as well um, I do have a little bit of a better one but uh if this performs it's pretty good this was literally one fifth the price of what I paid for my other one so if you can get the same performance for 20% of the price um, I'm all for it uh, especially in this economy so I'll let you guys I'll do a quick a quick video with these and then I'll try the impact screwdriver um, to see how they perform and then uh, we'll go from there I'll be back all right guys so let me show you guys real quick uh, these long wrenches make it really easy to just go in here just go ahead and start taking off bolts super simple So you guys can see there uh, let me see what else we can do here go ahead and just tighten this back up so you also got an eight on the other side really easy to do I think these are seven though on on this car. Yeah, these are seven. But um, usually most cars are eight. Get in there real quick. Do take off your air filter. Service your service your little air filter air filter here. If you have some sort of battery issue, flip it right over. And you got yourself a ten. Um, like right here. Just go ahead and lift this. Just go ahead and loosen it super easy like i told you guys and they are all double-sided just go ahead and tighten this back up honestly it's pretty fairly loose um yeah guys it's really cool little uh tool setup here especially this longer one you know a lot of the serpentine belts are 14 let me see if i can go ahead and go in here with one of this So this, this is the wrong size, but let me see if the 12 will fit. So it's gonna be the 13th, it's just my luck. Actually, those are 10. So like, I, it's like I'm telling you guys, it's really easy, especially when, since they're so long, you can go ahead and do this. I think there's a water pump right here. Yep, water pump, so you just break them loose like I did right now it back up but yeah make servicing cars really really simple um let's check the fitment out on these uh, so the 10 it does have a little bit of play let me see the let me try the 12 out on something i think this is a 12 here oh it's a 13 so 12 would be This one. No, these are all 13. Mm. Let me try this here. And these are and these are 15. Here, let me be right back. I'm gonna go get the the 13 and 15 real quick. All right, guys. Sorry about that. I'm back. So I found the 13. Uh, let's see the fitment. Honestly, the 13 is really tight. Let me see on this one. A little bit of play. It's not too bad. I've seen worse. I see the fifth. I see the fifteen now. They do have a little bit of play, but I mean, you kind of need it to go in, uh, so it's not bad. Let's try the. So what I do like about these long wrenches is it does make taking stuff like this off a breeze. Where like instead of you know you're over here with a small ratchet and then as soon as it breaks loose boom you get your knuckles you just hit it a few times and there that one's loose easy very easy i'll just 
hiding it back up. Yeah. So let me show you guys how these hose clamps work. Uh, so basically, you just you just want to get it like to the point where it. Uh, let me open this up. All right, so it's open, and then you just put just put it here. So you guys can see what I'm doing. See it closes, so you just put that there. You want ideally you want to get it from the top. Boom. It's that simple. See now you can move the whole clamp around. You don't have to worry about it grabbing your fingers. You could even lock it in place. Let me show you guys. Oops. So you might not be able to lock all of them in place, but Sorry guys, kind of hard with uh, one hand. Oops. <laughs> it's also making it harder because I'm using the phone through uh, to see the <laughs> what I'm doing. There we go. So once you get used to them, it should be a little bit easier. And like I said, I'm using my phone to see through it, so it's kind of hard. Uh, let me see if I can find a, a screw. We could try that impact screwdriver on. Hmm. Let me see if I can find something, and I'll be back. So unfortunately, I couldn't find any um, anything I can use this on right now. Uh, but be sure I will make a short out of this. Um, Whenever I get the next Honda, which will probably be soon, I get them quite a bit. Um, I do brakes. So I'll, I'll be sure to use this to show you guys how it works. Uh, but like I said, guys, uh, don't forget to look uh, look to the description for for better deals. Um, you you guys will get like a hundred dollars worth of coupons. Um, also, remember, guys, Timu is free shipping. As long as you go over like ten dollars or fifteen dollars, you will get free shipping, which uh, most of these items are about 15 and, and to 20. I think this one was like 17. These were about 18. This was the most expensive one about, I think this was about 50. Uh, these are about 20 and this is also about 20. So no matter which one of these you get, um, you will get free shipping. Uh, overall, like I like the spanners quite a bit, uh, wrenches. Um, this one's okay. It's a little quirky. Um, Maybe I gotta, maybe because I'm not used to it. Okay, so yeah, so I guess I have to pull and then let go. Okay, so that's what I'm, that's what I was having trouble with. So then open, okay, cool, yeah. So it's just, it's a little, I'm not used to this one. Um, I do have a different one. Uh, I think the other one is like OEM tools. It's a little bit different, but it, they, they do the same thing. Um, honestly, uh, these tools aren't bad, especially if you're starting as a mechanic. Um, especially this hammer, you know, it's just a hammer. And I, I like the... This handle, it's a pretty good handle. And I like that it... Um, on some of them, the base uh, ends about here. So I have seen where they pop out of this... Uh, things like polyurethane ha handle. Where you're, just, you're smacking and then it cracks and then it just flies off. Um, and then, of course, the wood ones just go straight in here. And you just have the head... I like that this one's one forged metal piece. I might have actually been welded, but hmm. I have to sand it down and probably see what it's made out of. But I'll, honestly, I've had similar ones to this and they hold up. Um, and keep in mind, I only spent like seven, eight dollars on those, so this is probably a fine tool as well. Uh, I got to use these. I'll probably make a short on this as well next time I do some tie rods. Uh, but overall, 
Uh, I do like these tools so far. Um, this one could be a little bit better, but uh, these wrenches, I like them quite a bit. Uh, hammer looks cool. I mean, hammer's a hammer, as long as it's not chipping. And this one looks like it's pretty, pretty well heat treated. Um, yeah, guys, remember, uh, this was thanks to Timu that sent me out these items. Uh, so be sure to, uh, if you guys are interested, click on the link. And um, you guys will get like $100 worth of coupons. Remember, guys, free shipping. And you'll also get the price guarantee, which means um, if any of these um, items change price within 30 days, you will get a you will get uh, the difference back. Um, I believe in, I believe in cre credit. I'm not 100% sure. But at least you can go and buy something else with that difference a lot of times. Um, like one other day I bought a, like one of those Game Boys. It was like 80 bucks. It went down to like 50 so they gave me 30 bucks in credit. So then I went and bought, I think I got like some headphones for my kids. And then uh, a, a few other little things. Like I think I got like some solder. But you know, it was, it's, it was free at that point. Since I already had the, like those clone Game Boys. But yeah, guys, remember if you guys like this video, don't forget to hit the thumbs up. If you like this content, um, consider subscribing. And stay tuned for more videos. Have a great day.